Hello there. Today we're going to be talking about how to add custom fonts to your Canva Pro account. So having a custom font in your Canva account is a fun way to make your designs unique. And I want to show you the easiest way to do that. So first off, we need to choose a font that we want to add to Canva Pro. I like to just search um, through Google fonts sometimes and look for some that I like there. These are all going to be free and then you can download them. Once you choose one, you can download it here and it's going to be saved in your download file on your computer. Also, I love Creative Market. Creative Market has tons of beautiful fonts and sometimes even font pairings like this one. This is Harlow. It's a font duo. So it has this pretty serif as well as a script font. And I'm going to show you how to add this, these two to Canva Pro now. So what we're going to do first is you're going to purchase it. You're going to add it to your cart. And I have already purchased this before, so I'm just going to download it again. So it goes into my download file on my computer. All right, so now that it's downloaded, I am going to open the zip file so it's ready to add to Canva. And I'm just going to make sure that I use the TTF file when I am adding it. Okay, so we're going to open up Canva, either an existing design or you're going to open a new design. And then you're going to select text or you're going to type in some text. All right, now that I have this text selected, this box pulls up here. And if I click on that little down arrow and I scroll to the bottom, you can see it says upload font here. So upload a font. And then I'm going to go to that download folder. And I'm going to double click on that opened folder. And then I'm going to grab the TTF. And I have a script and a serif and a plane. Okay. So I was holding down my shift key and that let me select all of them at the same time. And then I'm going to select open and then I'm going to say yes, upload anyway. Okay. Once those fonts are added to Canva, now we're going to try them out. So I have this selected here. Now I'm going to search for Harlow. And there it is there. So we have the regular, we have the plain. I'm just going to click on this and see if I like it here. I might want to bump up the size to fit better here. And then I'm going to change coaching to be the script. So we've got the script one right here. All right. So this is all caps, which I am not loving how that's looking. So I'm going to change that here. I might need to just type it in. I think I typed it in all caps. All right, and now the script is all disconnected, which doesn't look like a natural script, so we want to change that. So then the letter spacing, we'll just take it down to zero and see how that looks. All right, again, that's really small. So we're gonna bump that up. All right, so just by making those few adjustments with our custom font that we just added, we have a new logo that we're ready to use. All right, take care.